today's video. So y'all have been loving the husband wife content. So we decided to do something a little bit different and fun today. We're playing like an ultimate hide and seek with the husband. Yes. So you didn't happen to see Asa in this house, did you? No. Should I have? Dang it! He's not here! Hey, do you even know if he's here? I don't know, I'm trying to search. Uh, you want a hint? Yeah. He's not here. <laughs> My God. I don't really know what I'm expecting, like him popping out of a bush. I don't know. First, we wanna say thank you so much to Google Maps for sponsoring this video. Now let's get on to the rules. Asa and Dakota, our husbands, have both chosen hiding places and they have come up with hints to help us figure out where they are. So Bailey and I are going to look at the hints and try to figure out where they are. The hope is that we can get it faster than the other one. Yes, so it's a competition. Whoever gets little up words. It's whoever finds their husband first wins. Yes. So using the hints they gave us to here's find to hoping spot. Asa pulls through. Crossing fingers. I'm honestly not too confident. <laughs> Dakota hit somewhere I can know, <laughs> so we'll see. Right now, Brooklyn and I are just waiting at her house. We cannot start the game until Asa and Dakota both send us our first hints. I'm excited. Okay, I just sent Brooklyn her first clue. Hurry up, baby. Dakota just sent me my hint. I'm so pumped. I hang out here with me and my friend. His wife helps you stay on trend. Wow, Dakota with the rhymes. Somebody helped him. Somebody him helped him rhyme. Somebody, somebody helped him put that together. I'm going to Bailey in Brooklyn's office. She's actually my first clue. I'm just saying, this is the place where we spend most of our time. Okay, my hint just came in from Asa. In the place where we spend the most time. That's it? <laughs> Trying to get me to fail! That's Yours it. was like an art piece and mine is like this. <laughs> trying to come up with the places that Dakota might possibly be hidden, but I was gonna show y'all one of my favorite things about Google Maps that I'm going to like use currently right now, but you can click this button up here that says like add a new list, and I'm gonna just make a list that's like titled hiding places, and I can add locations to this list. So what I'm gonna do is come up with like four or five different places I think Dakota could be hiding, add it to the list, and then I'm able to go back, remember A, the places I came up with, but B, then I have all the locations in one spot. It's a way to save time, people. So also, we can compete. You can also add a location and then use an emoji as like the location name. So for example, if I were to like be talking about the softball fields, I could use like a softball as the emoji and then like whenever I want to map to it, I just click the softball. Yeah, it takes me there. Pretty cool. This is what it looks like creating the list and like using the emojis. Obviously this is just like a random version of that, but I think this would be really useful. Like I use it sometimes if I'm trying to plan like things to do in certain places. So if I'm traveling or like wanna create like an itinerary, you can use the list to like make all of that. Also you can share the list. So like if you're building an itinerary for a group of people, you can share it with them and they would also be able to see the list. Okay, I've been sitting here in the kitchen and I have come up with a decent list of places I think he is because his hint says hanging out with me and my friend, not friends plural, but friend. And then it says his wife helps you stay on trend. Well, I only have one of Dakota's friends whose wife works with me. Joselle is her name and her husband, Gavin, is Dakota's friend. So I'm thinking that he's with Gavin, in which case they would probably be at his house. So I'm gonna go to Gavin and Joselle's house first. Based off of Asa's hint, which wasn't much to go off of, there are three main places I spend most of my time. My house, the office, or my mom's house. And I'm gonna try and figure out the best route, which place I should check first. While I'm doing this, I do wanna tell y'all this cool thing that Google Maps has is called immersive view. It's basically like an interactive view of certain cities. You can see where you can plan on weather conditions. You can look at traffic flow. Like you can literally know before you go to these locations. It's super cool because if it's raining, you can see that on the map. You can see that in the immersive view you and literally plan your outfits according to the weather or you can plan your traveling according to the weather literally in this immersive view it's so cool it has like this 3d sort of preview I can't use personal locations like my address or anything so I just used a fake one using the Brooklyn Bridge because of Brooklyn little feature for Brooklyn yay so you can see what that looks like it's so cool and super helpful y'all I'm just saying you guys should download Google Maps by clicking the link in the description box below. Go you Google can use Maps. all these cool features for yourselves. We are yeah, ready time is about to, start. to go find these boys. 
I don't have a key. <laughs> so I'm just gonna like show up and uh, like sit around, I guess, until they find me. So here's to hoping that someone is there that they can let me in. Made it to my hiding spot. Let's see if it's unlocked. Well, I guess I'll be hiding outside. <laughs> Way too hot, I'm gonna go sit in the car. There's a squirrel that realized how uh, bored I was, so he came over to chill with me. What's up, dude? Sorry, no peanut butter. Ready, set, go! Run! Run to the car! Run to the car! Say hi to Sassy, everyone! No! No, I hope that doesn't impact my time! If I have to stop for gas, that's gonna be a major disadvantage. Before I even go anywhere, I'm gonna do a fun little fact about Google Maps before I drive to each location. So fact number one for the day, they have... First of all... No, hold on guys, camera adjustment time. Literally five minutes later. Haha, -ha. did you know that did you know that Google Maps has mapped 37 million miles or 60 million kilometers worth of roads? Just stew on that one while I drive to my first location. First place I decided I am going is to our friend Gavin and Joselle's house. But I just realized as I was like rushing out the door that I don't know their address. So hopefully Joselle responds quickly and sends me her address. Otherwise, I'm gonna lose a lot of time to Bailey. I have officially made it to my first location, which is my mom's house. Hey. Hello. You didn't happen to see Asa in this house, did you? No. Should I have? Is that a lie face? Is that a real face? Well, every time I lie, you guys think I'm telling the <laughs> truth, and every time I tell the truth, you think I'm lying, so you tell me. Paisley wouldn't lie to me. Paisley, have you seen Asa in this house? No. If they're telling the truth, then I may have picked the wrong location first. I'm gonna go around and look through a couple of rooms first, though. Okay, Giselle was literally a champ and sent me her address in two minutes. It's mapped, it's 24 minutes. It's a little bit longer than I was hoping for, but I'm gonna safely and by the law drive as quickly as I can to get there. There's a code on this door. Mom, what's the code? I'll block the camera while you do it. Unlock it! No. Told you. Dang it! I was hoping he was in here. I'm going upstairs. Let's see if he's in here. any of these rooms up here. Made it to Gavin and Giselle's house. I'm not seeing Dakota's car here, but he may have hidden it down the street. You never know. <laughs> hey! <laughs> Random, but is Dakota here? No, he's yes. not here. Can I look for him? I gotta go. I gotta look with my own eyes. Obviously, no Dakota in the living room. I'm gonna go check the backyard because you guys have a suspiciously large backyard. Paisley's just following me suspiciously. Nope. Hey, do you even know if he's here? I don't know. I'm trying to search. Uh, you want a hint? Yeah. He's not here. <laughs> Daxon is pinky swearing that Asa is not here, which means I've picked the wrong location. 41 oh, no. minutes? Yeah, 41 minutes. <laughs> I'm gonna text him to send me another hint. I don't really know what I'm expecting, like him popping out of a bush. <laughs> I don't know. So we have determined that Dakota is not at Gavin and Giselle's house. So now I'm confused because his hint pointed directly at Gavin. I'm gonna have to get the second hint from him so I can figure out where the heck he is hiding. So for my second clue, I said, go find me in a place where you will most definitely have a strawberry acai. Now come find me before 6.03. I said 6.03 because it's like 5.30 right now. Kind of clue her in to the fact that it would be kind of close to where she is currently. I just tracked her location just so I could see how far away she is. Looks like she's only about 20 minutes away from me. So she, if she left now, she should get here by 6.03. I texted Asa, he just sent me his second hint. Number two, you will find me in a place where you most definitely have a strawberry acai. Now come find me before 6.03. What does that mean? Why does he keep sending me things that are so generic? Bro, I drink them every day. Not helpful in the slightest. 
greatest. Since this hint, I'm just gonna go to the office. I'm assuming he means the office because I spent a lot of time there and I do have strawberry acais there. I think that's where I'm gonna go. Well, no luck so far. So, uh, baby, I'm gonna give you a hint number two. The real question is, how many hints am I gonna have to give? I'm in a beautiful spot. I've got some water, trees, and a playground. It says, you'll find me here on my free time with a drink in hand, and I'm looking fine. A drink in hand. That literally has to be Sip City. Like, why else would he put drink in hand? I'm gonna go to, I'm gonna go to Sip City. Okay, it's literally saying it's a 30 minute drive, which sucks because that means I had 30 minutes to Joselle's house and 30 minutes to this new location. And I'm like, scared Bailey's gonna beat me. I am confident we can do this. For those of you who might not know, Sip City is a business Dakota and I have just barely started. And the business has to do with like, drinks and obviously like drive through drink company. So I'm kind of thinking that this is where he is. So I just made it to Sip City and I'm about to go inside and check our building to see if this is where he's hiding. Oh no! I only have seven miles of gas left. I'm gonna have to make a gas stop. I'm definitely going to be so mad if I lose because I have to stop for gas. We have officially made it to the office. An hour and 16 minutes. I am really not making good time at this point, but I'm crossing my fingers. I picked the right location, the office. Let's go in and see if he's here. Okay, also the second fun fact about Google Maps is that you can find a bunch of information about a lot of businesses. So like reviews and ratings and directions and all that kind of stuff. I think with over 250 million businesses and I'm not gonna lie, Sip City is one of them. So when Dakota and I got Sip City on Google Maps, we literally celebrated for like a day because it's so fun to see your own business on there and you can like map to it. Like yeah, fun little facts about Google Maps. This is Sip City. Fingers crossed he's here. I do not see his car in the parking lot. My hopes are at like a 50% right now. He's not in here. Dang it! He's not here! I have a feeling that Bailey has already found Asa because her first clue was so much easier than mine. It limited it down a lot more. Dakota has hidden in the most random spot and I literally cannot find him. So I'm gonna get my third clue and hopefully, fingers crossed, find out where he is. Um, I just got my next clue and it is, this is your last take, find me by the lake. Definitely not the lake house, cause that's two hours away. Okay, I gotta think about it with all the clues put together. Oh my gosh, it's where we practice softball. Okay, I just checked Brooklyn's location and uh, she's currently at Sip City. So she must think that Dakota's at Sip City. Oh. The door was locked. <laughs> so I was right. It is the office. It's the office. Uh -huh. Did you make it by 603? 604. <laughs> okay, you made it. You made it. You guys, I did it. What were your hints? They were so vague. It was like where you have a strawberry acai. I'm sorry. I have strawberry acai's in literally every location. But you have it here every day because of me. I found him. You I, gotta, I gotta tell Brooklyn. I think that I want, oh, I need to get the time mark. An hour and 19 minutes, you guys. Mark that, because if I found him faster than Brooklyn did, then I won. I think I figured it out, obviously. It's, we've practiced softball with Gavin, who's on our softball team at this park with the lake in it. I am like almost 95% confident is where he's hiding right now. Can we just talk about the fact that he decided to hide outside right now? It's like 110 degrees. My husband, y'all, sometimes. Okay. Oh, it's only three minutes. Y'all, that's his car, which means we're in the right place. Now we just gotta find him in this whole entire park. Someone just pulled up. Looks like uh, my last hint helped a ton. Here she comes. He's been spotted. He's all the way over there. I found you. Woo! <laughs> all right, I found Dakota. She found me. I had job, two stops and then this one. So three stops. Total. Wow. Shout out to Google Maps for literally making it so easy for me to drive they everywhere. They made it too easy for you. It, no, I, we still don't know if I beat Bailey. <laughs> no. So we gotta go home 
and figure out who won the competition. Oh, it's a competition. Yeah, because who? if she found Asa before I found you, she oh, wins. Oh, snap. Yeah, you made it too hard. It knows a competition. Look who showed up. Yay! <laughs> we did the math and figured out that she found Dakota like 10, 10 minutes after, after I found oh, Asa. Thank God. I know you're excited. I just got home. <laughs> Hi. I think I won. Yeah, but I think she did win. I'm not gonna lie, I stopped one more place than she did. So I think like by default, I lost. I, well, I did have to I, get gas. He sat there and he's like, I didn't know this was a competition. I was like, what? This is the whole point of the video. I'm like, yeah. Uh, well, we do want to say thank you again to Google Maps for sponsoring this video and we will see you guys next week. Bye y'all.